I'm Chan Kiet Lim, and I'm a professor of piano at the School of Music and Performing Arts. Well, the course I'm offering that I have done it as a hybrid course is actually class piano or keyboard skills class. It is a class that's actually taken by all um, School of Music students who are not piano majors. One of the innate flaws of the classroom setting itself, the physical setting itself, is that you never get to see the teacher's hands. So for a class where you're learning how to play the piano, where it's all about the physical movement of the hand, it is very important that students are able to see teacher modeling, like demonstration by me. And so in the past, the fact that I'm facing 12 students who never see my, my hands is actually a basic flaw, you know, in the setting of the class itself. The other problem that I struggled with was that, you know, learning to learning music or playing any instrument for that matter, it is really a connection of the eye, the hand, and the ears. Because playing the piano is really not just about moving your fingers, it's being able to understand what you hear and what you see. So the online format or the hybrid format has enabled me to present my content online and as a result using a lot of multimedia content where I can link and connect the dots between these different skills. I think what is given me is more time and flexibility. So in the past, you know, with a traditional class, I have to be, of course, in class, I have to be present, I can only teach my material or most of my material when I'm in class. Uh, so now I think the flexibility is that I can have a lot of my teaching content outside of the classroom because it's housed online. So when I do see them in class, I can actually spend a lot of time instead of teaching, working to help them practice. So it's in a way, it's almost like a flipped classroom that I'm doing, but for class piano teaching. I think it has been positive, at least when I talk to them. <laughs> uh, I think they like it because it gives them flexibility. Well, number one, you know, they only meet with me once a week for most part of the semester, and I think they really love that idea of not having to come to class twice a week. But they are kept very busy, to be honest. Uh, but what I think they like is the idea that they have some flexibility in terms of how much time they're given for an assignment or how much time they can have for an assignment. So for example, for every week, I would have a slew of activities or assignments that are due. But these activities are very different in nature. Some are technical in nature, some are based on your listening skills, some are based on your reading skills. So. Students learn differently. So some students might find that, you know, things that are oral-based are very easy for them. And then some students struggle with coordination. So with this sort of like method where I say, okay, everything is due on a f Sunday, for example, the students can choose which are the easy assignments for them, which they will submit earlier. And the ones that they need more time, they have more time to work on it. So I think they get to cater to their needs, their learning needs. And then the other thing too is that they can work at any time that's convenient for them. So I think that is also a big plus for a lot of our students, especially as much as they work. Uh, since I've been here in, since 2002, the piano courses that we have offered has probably tripled in, in terms of number of sections. And so space is an issue because we are in the same building. And also of the nature of this class, because everything is limited by the number of pianos that we can have in the classroom, which are 12. So there are some problems since the number of students are increasing. So by doing this hybrid class, um, one of the things that we're thinking about doing in the future is to kind of meet for a Tuesday and Thursday class to just meet once a week as opposed to both times or not at all. That way I can sort of take two sections within the Tuesday and Thursday section. So one class will meet constantly for the whole semester on a Tuesday and then another class on a Thursday. So that really helps us with space issues that we're experiencing right now. I think there are a lot of courses that are very content driven and it's perfect for online. But for my class where I'm teaching a physical skill, I felt the need to be in contact with my students because I can then tweak the technique, I can watch how they play exactly, you know, and I can give them immediate feedback. Uh, I also like to have a really nice, good rapport with my students. That's one of the things that I really enjoy about teaching. And so I think the hybrid format was just perfect for me because it was the best of both worlds. I get to see my students, I can do ensemble activities, I can tweak their technique, but at the same time I'm able to put a lot of a content and multimedia content online that is also much more powerful than the way I used to teach. So I think it is, it really has changed the way I teach 
and I have been able to go much further in my course than I had in the past. So I say go for it. <laughs>